Eric, all right, let's go back to our uh, big accident we were talking about on 45. It's left the southbound lanes partially shut down in the woodlands. Channel 2's Kathy Hernandez is there right now this morning where a bus and an 18-wheeler have collided. So, Kathy, what's the situation there right now? Good morning. It is just a mess out here. As we've been telling you, an 18-wheeler hit a stalled Greyhound bus on the side of the road here of the North Freeway. It was actually in a shoulder of the North Freeway near the Woodlands Parkway. Sergeant Burst just arrived here to give us an update. Can you tell us what is going on? That's right. Well, approximately 2.30 a.m. this morning, a Greyhound bus was disabled on the side of the uh, uh, interstate. At approximately just before 5 o'clock a.m., it was struck by an 18-wheeler. The bus was occupied with what we know right now, approximately 26 occupants, including the driver. Um, during the crash and the investigation, the second bus that was going to switch out the occupants showed up. Second Greyhound bus showed up. So 21 of those passengers were transported onto the bus that was en route to Houston, and five were taken to Memorial Hermann by ground. Can you tell us about their injuries? Life, uh, Non-life-threatening injuries. Everybody seems going to be okay, including the driver of the 18-wheeler. Do we know what the 18-wheeler was carrying? Right. Uh, looks like water. Bottled water. Do you, do you have any information on the condition of the truck driver? Um, Non-life-threatening injuries. Stable. That's where we're at right now. How long will these lanes be closed? Do we know? Well, we have three lanes open, and that's what I was trying to put out right now. So we've got three lanes open. We're doing pretty good trying to get everybody south that needs to be, but um, it's going to take us a couple more hours before we can get the actual vehicles that are crashed off the roadway. Those other passengers, where are they now? Well, the 21 passengers are headed to Houston. The five passengers that are still at the Memorial Harmon Hospital are being evaluated before they're released. Do we know where this bus was coming from? We, the bus is coming from Dallas en route to Houston. Advice for drivers and people here in this area? Well, right now, use caution coming through the area. Please move slowly. Don't try to look at the crash scene. There's nothing you can do about it right now. Just get to your destination. Follow the instructions of the law enforcement officers that are out on the roadway and be careful for all the law enforcement officers and record drivers that are out here right now. Do you mind just saying again kind of how the crash, um, who caused the crash, how it was initiated? Well, it's still under investigation, but the uh, Greyhound bus was disabled on the side of the roadway. Okay. As you heard, that's an update from Sergeant Burst with DPS. They are still here, and as you heard from him, there were two buses here when that 18-wheeler slammed into one of them, and then five people have been transported to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. So, of course, we're going to continue to follow this developing story, keep you updated on air and online at click2houston.com. Reporting live in the Woodlands, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.